was scary, I know, like, to leave at, like, 16 years old, you got nobody here. Coming from South Sudan and, and, and getting over here to the States, being in high school, and then getting a Division One scholarship, not many players that get that opportunity and make the most of that opportunity and are willing to roll the dice on themselves. Come here, leave all my family, I don't have anybody in my family here, and just, you know, to, like, that's, that's also the important part about, about like, me joining here to feel like I'm in the family atmosphere. He's one who will always be a part of our family. I'm just glad, you know, to spend that four years here and build a lot of, like, long relationship that are gonna last more than basketball. I love the game of basketball. Obviously, I started playing it. I didn't even know <laughs> I'd be here. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a soccer guy, most of people know that, but and then I started playing basketball because of, of course of my height. Everything just like moved fast and I find myself like, hey, you're gonna go to US, play basketball and also like have a good education. So I think that was a, that's like opening eye for me. It's, there's no better thing like, you know, doing something you love at the same time, using it as your job to get paid for it. It was scary, I know, like, to leave at, like, 16 years old, you got nobody here. But I know it was necessary after, like, my dad passed, and I think that was, like, a good chance for me also, like, to go to school. And my mom always, like, preached about the school and stuff like that. It's, she, she, she would not let me leave. It was just, if, if it was just for basketball. But when she knew that I would go to school, get a free education, I end up one day going to college and get my degree. That's, that's the only reason she let me go. And it was hard to come over here and stay all the seven years, you know, knowing that like I left like my family behind. It was coach uh, war after we talked and I saw his vision about like where he's going with this program. You know, he was a young man that we thought had, had great promise and we needed a guy that had length and could block shots and give us a presence defensively and Koch can do that. And then offensively, his games just developed every year. So he's come in and really helped us become the defensive rebounding team that we've wanted to be as a program. And I told him I'd like to be part of that and just came in my unofficial visit, saw the arena, and talk to Coach, and I love everything about it, so I'll come in right away. Well, I just think coming from South Sudan and, and, and getting over here to the States, being in high school, and then getting a Division One scholarship, not many players that get that opportunity and make the most of that opportunity and are willing to risk it. It was hard for Louis because I don't have anybody here, you know, you know, in family aspect, that's one of them. Second thing was like language, so I was just like, sitting in class and just people like talking a lot of stuff and I just couldn't catch up like all oh, couldn't like you know understand some of the stuff that they said and I also went to prep school so I have a lot of international students so everyone have his own way of speaking English so it was hard for me like which one do I need to use the most like you know to speak Europe accent in general and some people from like you know even US here have like from different areas everyone has a different accent so it's been hard for me just to like you know which one do I need to like use to learn English fast? A lot of my family draw, like my stepsister, she's like a big artist. She likes to do fashion drawing and stuff like that. My stepbrother also drawing a lot of like, you know, human figures, stuff like that. So I take the drawing and just put like paper on top of it and start tracing it. And I just like fall in love with it and I just kept doing it, doing it, and then over time, like, become easier to me, and, and then I started making my own, like, drawing too, and it was just some, something I was passionate about. There's a little sketchbook that I keep with me every time, and just when I feel like drawing, I just start drawing there, and also become, like, my escape, like, when I was here in the U.S., like, you know, when you have that little moment, like, you know, a little homesick stuff like that, you just put, like, you know, start drawing stuff, put it, uh, put the emotion, emotion into it and yeah, it's, just, it's just beautiful to draw and stuff like that.
It was wonderful after seven years to go see my mom, see like my little sister, my little brother. It's, it was great. It was great just to like get that experience after a while. I don't know how to, to describe it to you. It's just like it was a lot of joy. After coming out of like winning the conference tournaments, and it's just like back to back, like just, you know, wonderful moment. Like it's going to be one of those memories that I'll not forget. I'm just glad, you know, to spend that four years here and build a lot of like long relationship that are gonna last more than basketball. His brothers in that locker room, I mean, I, I think he would say that those are his closest friends, guys that he's with day in and day out. And I think he's just opened up more every year. He's let people know who he is and what his, what his family's about, where he's from. And, and I just think that confidence has grown and his relationships have grown with it come here, leave all my family, I don't have anybody in my family here, and just, you know, to, like, that's, that's also the important part of it, about, like, me joining here, to feel like I'm in the family atmosphere. He's one we'll, we'll, we'll always be a part of, our family, um, just like these, all these three seniors are, but God, just, he's a special young man with a huge heart, very smart, and, and, and we're excited to see where he goes. Oh, I don't know, it's been fast. Uh, I know it's gonna come to an end one day, but, I didn't expect this going to be that fast, but it's been wonderful so far. Like I love, I love every minute about it. Five, four. Here now, three on the touch bar. He's back up. He's lifting up. One. And no!